seller or somebody who wants, they can just call 632-9518. KLTF Trading Post. Good morning, caller. Yeah, I have a snowblower that fits a John Deere garden tractor, 316, for sale. My number is 630-2521. 630-2521, a snowblower that fits... Hello, folks. Well, hello, folks. Up here at the pole shed, Danny Hamclump, he uh, uh, plowed the snow out of here so he could drive in here when we get the motor out for the 49 Ford. I'm going to shovel this out, and hopefully the doors are not froze shut so I can get them open. Well, here she is. She's been under this tarp since 2014, I think. Let's see what she looks like. Well, looks like the squirrels or mice made a little nest up on there. I have to take all this stuff off. So I was going to put it in a 94 GMC. So it has a... Uh, I think there's another pair of exhaust manifolds somewhere here. But it's got power steering stuff on it. And it's got an air conditioner pump brackets, I think, too. Like all that stuff needs to come off of here. But there she is. That's what we're going to uh, try to use to repower that car with. He might come here because he wants to take his baler oh. to Ron's. Oh. Remember? Okay, I'm a, yeah, I'm a bit wired. I guess. Okay, yeah. I'm going to pick up and make a wire over there. And if we ever go ice fishing. When? And if we ever go ice fishing. Yeah. <laughs>
this this will all have to come off because this is all fuel injected. Oh yeah. So I have to put a carburetor. Oh yeah. Where, where, where got the motor from? From Hell's 55 Chevy. Oh, oh, okay. Or the one that was at Dean's? Yep. Royalton? Yep. Yeah, it came out of there. Oh. <sighs> yeah. I took it to college. I don't know. You know we were going to put new seals in and put it in that truck, but we never did. Okay. So. Good night, guys. Toodles. You're a